is uh, for Shay. Um, how proud of you about this group of guys? Yeah, um, very proud. Obviously, um, this group is uh, has a lot of character and went up against a lot of adversity this year, and, and we proved a lot of people wrong in, um, in a tough year to boot where uh, things weren't normal and guys stuck together and um, battled hard and, and obviously, uh, you know, I wouldn't change it for anything and I'm super proud of these guys. Next question, Eric Engels. Yeah, this question's for Kerry. Kerry, um, we know how, how long you and Shea have both yearned for an opportunity like this, but can you envision having another one come soon now that the young players on this team got to not only experience this, but also learn from the veteran guys that are in this room, the guys that obviously garner so much respect? Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, you know, it's incredibly uh, you know, disappointing, but... Uh... So just I'm um, only disappointed in the result. A lot of our young guys did get a lot of uh, experience, but uh, you know it's hard to hard to look ahead right now. So we'll just uh, you know take some time off and regroup and lick our wounds and get back at it eventually. Next up, JF Shamat. Good evening, guys. Kerry, I know that it's not an easy time uh, right now, but if you have the chance to talk with your teammates, what would you like to say to, to them? Oh, I'm just proud of them. It's, uh, you know, it was an incredible run that we had. And that's uh, all there is to say. Next question, Guillaume Lefrancois. Hi, uh, Shay. Uh, on the ice after the game, we saw you, you know, hugging a lot of, of teammates. What, what was your your message to your teammate as as their captain? Um, I think the same message that Kerry said. Obviously, I think a lot of us are lost for words right now. Um, to be honest, it's uh, it's tough. I think everybody knows that you play for this reason. You get so close and. Um, just, uh, just can't get it done. So I think that, uh, like Kerry said, we're proud of everyone, but at the same time, I think uh, we learn from this and um, the young guys and, and everybody takes experience from it and, and comes back from it. Next question, John Loop. Question for, uh, for both Shay and Kerry. Um, guys, um, did this whole experience feel perhaps more intense just because this wasn't a normal year, so to speak? Not, yeah, I no, don't really know kind of what you're trying to get at, but uh, it was different. I think everybody realized with the division realignment and uh, the schedule, especially, um, you know, some of the teams getting their schedules all mixed up with uh, COVID cases and whatnot. So it was definitely a, a different season overall. Next question, Arpan Basu. Um, hey, question for Carrie. Um, I don't really know how to ask this, but can you share something that just your initial thoughts at the end of the game, obviously having to watch a celebration that you wanted to be a part of, could you just share a little bit of what was going through your mind in that moment? Just, uh, like I said, just disappointment. It's, uh, it's not fun to, to watch somebody else do what you want to be doing. Whether you're uh, watching it on TV or standing there on the bench, it's still the same feeling. We'll do two more for the guys. Next one is Richard Lebec. Yeah, well, uh, for, bo for both guys, uh, in the end, what did you think was the, the difference in this series? Uh, you know, at the end of the day, I just don't think, uh, you know, I played well enough at the start of the series. I don't think that's the case at all, to be honest. I think that uh, we weren't good enough in front of Kerry. They were, I mean, give them credit. They're a heck of a team. They're here for a reason, and um, they were they were better than us in the end. And our last question comes from Alexei Ballinger-Champagne. Thank you. Question for Shay. Just to, what will you remember about this 2021 season in the end when you look back at it? 
I don't know. It's hard to say right now. Um, great group of guys. One of the tightest groups that I've had in 16 years. And a lot of that, uh, um, you know, weird season, you could say it uh, brought us close together and the difficulties brought us closer. And um, we had a lot of fun with uh, with what we uh, what we could do.